find out what their needs are going into the 2024 elections. Now, we've been here for hours, and this has been the atmosphere since we got here. For about two hours straight, there has been a lot of jama, and it feels like a rally. It feels like a rally out here today. So we're going to try to have this conversation in spite of all the noise in the background. So bear with us. If you're watching us live and you live in the Tema Central constituency, we invite you to be a part of the conversation. And the Member of Parliament aspirant for the NDC is already here, A.B. Bright. She's here and seated. And we're told that the Member of Parliament aspirant for the NPP, Charles Forsen, would also join us shortly. All right, so we begin. Ago, 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 Cho Boy, Cho Boy, Cho Boy, Mepa Machao, Yaba the Shasie, it's Yenina, Yent Nasi. All right, uh, we're going to try to have this conversation in spite of all the noise in the background, and we'll start first by speaking to Abby Bright. Abby Bright is the Member of Parliament aspirant for the NDC. Can I have a microphone for her, please? Can I have a microphone for Abby Bright, please? All right. So this constituency has a voter population of over 60,000 Ghanaians. And so it's a very important and significant constituency going into the 2024 December polls. Abby Bright, good morning. Good morning, sweetheart. It's great to see you. You look lovely. Thank you very much. Good morning to um, all our viewers, listeners. Uh, good morning to all of Ghana. Welcome to Tema Centra. Thank you for having us. The atmosphere is really charged. Uh, this is one of the, I think, one of the first constituencies we have arrived at to find us a, a full-blown rally going on, waiting for us. Uh, uh, is, is, is this how it always is? <laughs> well... It's taking some doing. Uh, Tama Central used to be very boring politically. You know, it was just considered a stronghold of the MPP and everybody and everything was taken for granted. But we were determined that um, political gains for we, the constituents, were going to go way and beyond the usual partisan politics and to have a new era of inclusivity a new era of activity so that the people, the constituents feel a lot more involved. They're more active in the political process. And like you're saying, there's a full-blown rally. And yeah. as you can see, as active and as boisterous as it is, it is very peaceful. Yes. So this is a new Tema Central. All right, let's try not to cross the cameras. Let's try not to cross the cameras. All right. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Let's try not to cross the cameras. Well, all right, yes. Like I was saying, this is the new Tema Central where there are active participants on both sides. Okay. Where finally, you know, there's not just one political party here. We also exist, we're a strong force. And we're looking forward to better decisions because of it. Well, I should congratulate you for being able to, I don't know, turn things around in terms of the excitement in the constituency going into the elections. Like you said, in, in the past, it's, we, at least in news media, considered Tema Central Constituency as an MPP stronghold. And so it was an MPP stronghold and, and that's what it was. But coming here today and seeing the full-blown rally outside and the people who have come with you, it, it looks like you've whipped up some excitement going into the elections. But let me, well, let, let me, let me speak to um, my brothers on this side. Good morning. Uh, can we have a microphone? Um, Yes, are you. All right, all right. Me pa ma chao. Get up and tell them to come. All right. All right. 
tell your supporters to calm down. Tell, tell, tell your supporters to calm down. I mean, tell them to calm down. Yes, tell them to calm down. All right. Calm down. All right. I go. All right. Me pa ma chow, ma nye di ya, ye nti she. Why? Inti ye nye di na ye nti. Ye nye di na ye nti. Why? Ye nye di na ye nti. Yes, please go. Eh, eh, jo. Eh, eh, jo. Eh, eh, jo. Eh, 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 jo. Eh, eh, jo. Eh, eh, jo. Tama Central! Tama Central! Tama Central! Hello! Tama Central! We are here, we are here to prove to the whole constituency and the whole of Ghana why Abi Bright should be MP. So please, so please, let us have calm. I beg you. So please, let us commit to calm. I beg you. I beg you, I beg you, thank you. Thank you so much, AB. All right. Mr. Faustin, how are you? I'm fine. I'm great. Thank you for having us in your constituency. Thank you for hosting us. And this, when we host Community Manifesto, normally our expectation is that people in the community will come out to speak to their leaders to find out exactly what the expectations are going into the 2024 elections. But it's beginning to look like we might be having a debate today between you and A.B. Bright. And we will also speak to the people to find out what the expectations are. But before we begin our conversation this morning, can you just tell us briefly, this constituency has been known as an MPP stronghold. Going into the elections, going into the elections 2024, what should we expect? I mean, we, we expect a total win. The MPP expect a total win. In that, we've done so much for the constituency. And as a person, I'm doing the same. I'm doing the same for the con constituency. And going to the election, we expect nothing light. Nothing less than 76% win. That is why, why we believe that uh, we are going to retire almost every NDC in Tama Central for them to join the MPP pool after December 7. You are going to retire the NDC, you said? Of course, we are going to. Now, uh, okay, our vote dropped a little, but we're going to move it to 73%. Yes. Say that again. Our vote in, 20, in 2020, we came down a little above 60%. But we're going to move it to somehow 73 percent that is what we are going to we are going to retire her permanently you're going to retire her permanently permanently permanently, but let's, permanently. let's talk about permanently. Permanently. let's talk about the real issues on the ground now what are some of the things what are some of the things or solutions that the npp seeks to bring to the people of Tema Central constituency. We've had a few conversations with people who live here since we arrived, and some of the things they have complained about or asked about, so youth unemployment, security, sanitation, the roads. These are four key issues that I have gathered since I entered the constituency this morning. Can you speak to any of these things and the solutions you intend to bring to them if you become MP? I'll, I'll speak to all four. Okay, all you four. Youth unemployment is so high in our constituency. All right. As a person, uh, I'm partnering about 50 institutions, each giving them a seed capital of 20,000 to be given to. 10. You are currently partnering yes, 50 yes, institutions. Yes, yes, yes. I see. Which institutions? No, I can't they? mention them, but they are out there. The youth are out there. Are they based in Tema? Yes, they are all Tema, the Tema right. Central constituents. And they are giving seed capital to young two, people. 2,000 cities each. each each institution, we are we are partnering ten youth from each of the 50, 50 uh, institutions. So in all, I believe that by close of this year, I'll be able to empower not less than five hundred youth in my constituency, out of my okay. own pocket. Out of your own pocket. Yes, yes. But is that a sustainable way to do it? Coming. 
is that sustainable? Yes, it is. Now, there are a lot of factories here in Tema. And so, that you know. Come to that. All right. All right, my, my good friend who has a self plant. Just last week, we were able to employ as many as 12, 12 of our, 21 of our, our youth in there. I have the links, I'm talking to most corporate bodies. Who would have, but you see, I'm a businessman myself. I cannot go beyond the threshold of employing, maybe if my organization can employ no more than a handful. I cannot go beyond that because it's a going concern. All that I'm saying is, because of the lack, I'm, I'm in my own capacity, in my own capacity, I'm creating that enable environment by empowering the youth to seed capital. In your own capacity. Yes. All right, so you're talking on youth and unemployment. Yes. Let's talk about security. Sewage. No, sewage. Sewage. Okay, Out of sanitation. my own pocket, we've started uh, sewage maintainers. Every Saturday, Sunday, and holidays, we go from each electric area to So now we've done almost all, all, we are solving almost all the sewage situations in the out of my own pocket. Out of your own pocket? Yes. yes. Your personal money? Come again. Your personal money? Yes, my personal money. But is it sustainable to use yes, your personal is, money to it solve is. the sewage problems in the yes. entire constituency? So now, if you go to Committee 8, it's okay. almost solved all. If you go to Committee 7, it's almost solved all. When you go to Committee 4, we're there throughout the, the holidays. So there's almost no sewage problem in this constituency as of now? We are, I'm sure by the close of this month, all, all, all sewage issues will be a thing of the past. Okay. And security. I've, I've spoken to the regional police command. I've secured street lights from this, this week. We've, we've started street the, lights? Yeah, street lights. Okay. We are brightening almost every corner in the constituency. And the police. The so the street lights are up now? Yes, yes, we have started. You have started? Yes, we started, yes. And, and this started when? Coming. When did it start? Uh, we have our electoral area. We began this week. We have, we have our electoral area coordinators, whom we are working with. The party uses the electoral area coordinator structure. Uh, you began this week? Yes. Why have you waited to begin this week? Ottawa. When you go to Ottawa, we started. I see. Yes. All right. And, and, the, final, and the final issue, roads. Roads, yes. And infrastructure. Tama Centra, we have most, most of the good roads. However, we have some fewer inner roads which yes. are deplorable. The inner city roads. Yes. Uh, last week, I was, I was at the urban roads. We are doing our possible best to fix the, the road, the inner road in front of better, better materials. Corporate. It's a major road. Uh, Roman St. Joseph. We, are, we intend fixing it before the election. So, give or take, I think uh, by close of the year, we'll do about three, three of the major, major roads. There's a bypass from Kaiser Flat up to Tamawide, just here. Which One of the major issues that come up during elections are questions about whether or not it is the responsibility of the member of parliament or member of parliament aspirant to do things like fixing roads and bringing infrastructure development to the constituency. No, I, do, I don't believe that the member of parliament is responsible for fixing yes. the rule. However, the person can lobby. The person can tap into corporate social responsibility of other corporations to fix it. So are you currently lobbying for these things to be done or are you promising to do it as a member of no, parliament? No, I'm lobbying. You're I'm lobbying. lobbying? Yes, I'm lobbying. All right, yes. let me talk to you, A.B. A.B., so just, just as I asked uh, Mr. Forsen, there are... All right, so... There are four key issues which the young people on the streets of your constituency have brought to my attention since I came here today. They've spoken about youth unemployment, they've spoken about security, sanitation and sewage issues, and some of the inner city roads which they believe need looking at. Can you speak to any of these issues? Um, let's, let's start with youth unemployment. Thank you very much. Um, on behalf of the people of Tema Central, the youth especially, and I'm one of them, I am outraged at Mr. Charles Forsen. And I feel righteous enough to express my anger because I'd like to ask him, when it comes to youth unemployment, he's a businessman as he claims. Number one, you're giving seed capital of 2,000 CDs to youth. How many youth? 
to do what as a businessman? What does he need most today? Is it uh, capital or does he need opportunity? 2,000 cities into his business creates what? When you don't create the enabling environment, how does that benefit the youth? We have Tema Central, which used to house workers. We have the, the, the industries in our own industrial area. We have the heavy and the light industrial area. And the residences, which used to house workers. You have companies that are collapsed because they are not sustainable, they are not viable. We're looking at things that produce or provide solutions on a mass sustainable scale. So you asked him a very key question which he failed to tap into. Is it sustainable? Giving 2,000 CDs to youth without any uh, uh, business support, without any guidance. How do you manage startups with 2,000 CDs in this economy? Why don't you address the issues which make our youth not employable? Why don't you address the issues which make it impossible for them to sustain small businesses, no matter how little or how big the capital? So for me, it's a very fundamental issue that I don't appreciate him what, toying what, with. What, what plans do you have to address the issue of youth unemployment? Should you be elected member of parliament? Thank you very much. I made reference to the heavy industrial area, which house our companies. These are companies which largely employ from outside the constituency. You asked him a question. Are these people resident in Tema Central? The youth unemployment is high in Tema Central without the notice of the rest of the country because the companies that we house are not employing our residents. What's because we're for? not training. We need to train the youth to fulfill the responsibilities of the designations that are waiting for them in the companies. We're looking at a 24-hour economy. It means improved or increased production. It means that we're supposed to, to um, support these businesses to thrive. But if they thrive and they, are, um, and they are recruiting from outside the constituency, of what use is it to us? The first two times I stood, I was talking primarily to the residents of Tema Central and explaining to them about opportunities for them. But today, I have the added, you know, the added portfolio of representing the businesses in Tema Central and reminding them of their responsibility towards the community that houses them. So I cannot be an MP only for the residents and to share money to residents, but I must be an MP who makes sure that the companies are thriving so that they take up their responsibility to employ our youth. All right. All right. All right. There is a microphone which Mepa Machao, your microphone was high. You bet to me, Obia, I send me a dawa kuma soa, Opesa Wokano. Who bet to me, Abejina Mike no ho akasa, your market nintino, Yabema, your jadu for no more market nakasa first. Now, Musumet to me akasebi, Obia Oba, who are one minute, I order Bekasa, who are Sembia, Opesa Wubusa, MP as far as now, who's me Bissawamu. And I say, Ebia, Obia can be Bia, Ebia, I wouldn't in ya, Jinga, and I and yes, sir, would to make her now Obia at your say, constituency way, way anyway, na Ecoso, Ebia and Cassavia, and Tocasavia, and Mamba Mosso. Why? So I'll just, I'll just leave the issue of unemployment for a second. Let's go to sewage. I'm upset to imagine that you say with, by the end of the month our sewage woes will be over. And as if the sewage is, is not, it, it is a fundamental problem in Tema Central. It cuts across all communities. Apart from the fact that existing infrastructure is woefully inadequate. Apart from the fact that our streets are seeping and leaking sewage. We have a whole industrial area. Our light industrial area has no sewage infrastructure at all. 
So this is not a situation that we can address with the usual daily firefighting. You say even last week, I gave them 2,000. They put a stick in. They unblock the gutter at so -so, so Road or so -so, so Road. This is an issue that requires a national intervention. This is an issue that is on the scale of a redevelopment for Tema. This is an issue that is at the heart of Tema's, or especially Tema Central's, redevelopment needs. So the sewage issue is not a trifle issue. It is upsetting us on a daily basis. It is on our streets and in our bedrooms. It is in the bedrooms of residents of Tema Central. It is not a trifling issue. Okay. Well, we are calling on the government to take a second look at the issue of sewage and to not leave it at the mercy of individuals. Hello. Our sewage issues cannot be left at the mercy of the ingenuity of individuals. It is a much larger issue. When it comes to security, I think that everybody knows that when it comes to lighting up Tema Central, this is a project that has been at the heart of the AB Bright campaign. From the first campaign in 2015, I gained the moniker Bright Lights because I put in a project that provided about 500 street lights within the Tema Central enclave. I worked with assemblymen and unit committee members to light up all the streets. Now let's go back to the lighting issue. Today, our security issues are a lot bigger than just street lights. If you go to the industrial area, the same industries which we are hoping will thrive and employ our youth, the number one challenge that they have is their security. Armed robbery, encroachment by squatters, and our inability to provide proper housing, affordable housing for residents is a major issue that is threatening the viability of businesses in the industrial area. So these are the security issues beyond lighting. But the lighting project, it will be a shame for him to take uh, credit for. Because that is my flagship lights. project. So, so both of you have been providing street lights. Well, I'm happy that he's come on board and he's following in my footsteps right. as far as the street lights are concerned. All right. The next issue we have to do with roads. Okay. I'm sorry that After the road point will go to the general public. Yeah, I'm sorry that the roads issue is a major issue that he cannot make light of. The whole of the light industrial area, which houses our fabricators and our repairers. This is where we actually repair cars, damage cars and we produce ovens that are uh, distributed all across West Africa. Our artisans, our technical and vocational activity is at the light industrial area. That place has no road infrastructure to speak of. The heavy industrial area, which houses DVLA, Tor, Vaco, and all of those companies, which are essentially the pulse of this nation's economy, has a horrible road network that make it inaccessible and increase the time of commuting for businessmen and workers. That is, an, a, 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 is a major issue. We have the road which was started under the NDC government, the linkage between Tema, Central, and Clagon. That has been under construction. The current MP, to give him credit, has also done a lot of work concerning that. However, if we continue to downplay our issues, it is very unlikely that we will resolve them properly. So I'll ask him to come again and be serious about the challenges in Tema Central. Thank you very much. All right. All right. Me pacho. Me Let's go to the market women and then we'll come to you. No, let's just go there. We'll come back. We'll come back to you. All right. Me pacho. Sisi ayebiye microphone. Obia wa sem kambia. Uwa one minute or the beka sa. Because 
se ye di etudwa e na meka a kire mu di edi kan no kas no etwe mu a no kwasem ne ye na pam 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 no e do so kakra ma ye kas ni chema de wo mu ye speed na ano odin di to so mu ye nu ye besre ye hia light e wo market ya street light a e bobo ba bia e betimi aboa ye because ye na akronfo e wiya ye wo dwomwa wo de wa de to okro ano ana ya fa ya na nkrofo e wiya ye e de edi wo bio no ye dwa na market no musi ma ye no ye sramo ala ye sramo e musu sa market ni musu sa e musu sa ma ye ye pa mu chao sa no nso no monya hu bibi e ma ye mu mie mu kakra e ma ye se de be ya ye betimi anya ba bi atena na ye ho anha ye e na de eto su e bie mu no nso no aha e na de eto su e bie mu no nso no ye sramo a ni e wo information center bi wa ha ye timi kasam anka mu be enu mu ne be ya announcement se tv3 fo bi pese o mu ba ha mpp ni ndc fo pese o mu ba ha no mu ne be kasa ye machines ni nyina sai enti apa mu cho mo 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 dia me machines ni ye ya ne ye ya ye ne bubo odwom ya asai mo me ye ma ye na ye nya bi emfa mo bo ye market anum se de be ya ye betimi akasam abatu ayi bebe obi ba wo nya machine bi akasam me de me kasa e twa to ye sram aye ye ma aye di dwa ye hia moa ye hia sika amoa ye pamu chyo mo moa ye ye da ma se yes da ye da wa se no we will have six comments and then we'll come to you all right yes sir Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, madam, uh, thank you. You have one minute, sir. My name is uh, Baba Tunde, uh, Assembly Member for Otukocha Electoral Area, Thomas okay. Central. The patrol uh, appeal any I drink Chiaka Kra, Emma in Penifua, Amotia, say, Sir, I'm a strong one. Thomas Central, you are very fortunate because you are road. You road most of your road. Moving forward, no. Best strong, no. So you are going to be a good guy, and you will be a good guy. You are share your water crisis. For now, Thomas, and that Thomas Central, they be a your two pipe. You see, I know Thomas. You are in such a way, say if you be a our washroom. You see, I say two pipe. Any fan, you be a good guy. You be a good guy. You are a good guy. Measure at least every electoral area be a water reservoir and bra community move. Moving forward, no Tama. First, you need to say Tama. You can say football. Tama, you say you produce most footballers. But it's essential that also you cause football no a good. It's many four. I'm more as it's so many a kunya some be so many. I'm more many enko football side. Football, okay. That's also touch to be on air sanitation. The last point, the last point, okay. That touch to be on air sanitation. Ya hwe tama ya siwa lines ni nyina essa mestre obi bi obenya kwenya no ombo a because ya assembly man all the age man but ya nje common fan the age an setting allowance it na ma bi wa eight me fa sa means ni enye nti ya penifu no ya nyina ya bra together na hwe na develop community no same on sewage and as a sanitation no ya hwe as see a border contractors na ya dey community na shi show mo san omo nya effective you see a bobo ya any truck pushes in our weird mouth community, which are the account for ever community. No, but you are better baller, baller, or you baller and another go to infiltrate. Say, you might have a person, and then you pop up with my assembly. No, community members, and OBBA, Nanka, and Boom, not to my central, and your crabbish. Thank you, yes, madam. Hello, hello, hello. Me pa cho mi a mi jina e mi divi Antoinette Avenogbo. Yes, madam. Eh, me sramu ya constituency. Ya major problem ba ko. Oh, ya major problem ba ko. Eh ye manholes no. Manholes. Yes, sewage no. Yes. Sewage. Eh, a very serious issue. Okay. I be mo start the air tackle, which I recommend them. Me sram two. Is your no mo tu tu mo no? Where any NDC, any MPP asem. Obia is involved. I'm going to meet you soon. Four days, five days. What point fish up? I said, I will cut bread. I will cut pens. You, your youth, no. I'm going to edge man. Obedu, baby, I know my boy, my one. Yes, I am. I know my man. 
ya brush on mono, na ye di a bobo. What is the cash or basa we did twenty two, twenty three? Expecting se or ye juma, not the sicabano, oba who not tea, baby, oba who not bad influence. Na we no me si ya dia ya common. I can't me pa my nominasa. We no mun a ya common ya youth in this say. It mumma ye pay juma and my youth no and fawo se or what and this or what and pp. Mumma ye CC or my no. We should look up to Yemba no no here in future. And a problem at that one, yes, solve it. Ye chai, no mana, ye 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 won chen chen. Ye pai boni se, se ene be pati ene be ba, on pua e non ye juma. All right. Pati bin e be ba, on pua bin non ye juma. All right. Ba we ba, we si mi pati, enye mi pati. We ba o se enye mi pati, na e juma nu da so da ho. Na ye in te ma mufu o nu. Ye da ye bre. Cho boy. Yeah. Maka se. Ye da wa se. Mi pa cho aka ni pa fo. I can't even afford. Now you're bahar. You're best answer bahar. Uh huh. What's say? Yes, sir. Pacho. Me pacho. Obe can be bina se. Obi a boso dada. E who here say won't so best aka. So say I can't see which one sem. I can't. In so na ye tum no pipe no one sem. I can't youth unemployment. I I I can't. We no any in your mind ya emphata. Inti e no na won't so bad be can. E who here so best answer boso bina. Me pacho. I can't da ho. Ah, me dance. Your friend is smiling. I would be Brahim Zampaligiri. The more can I say, Michachi and Panifomo had in Annette in Vitromo de Jumadi, Eba has a Edica Michami, Madame, may be bright in Panifomo had in Anne Charles Watts and Penifomo Swaha. The more can I say, Madame may be bright when DM Pida Nanso or Bayano or Ba or Satis or Bepre a Cunyani be twenty sixteen. Watch a light. Am my assembly members in there? So we are MPP. So we are NDC. Watch them. I will be beer. Watch them. I center her. So MPP. Because I'm a boy. Now you say now. Continue to know when you move. And here number one. Ena BM. Ena BM. So say ya me ne mo kasai. Assembly one. I'm a light here. I watch some of them. Assembly members. No. I'm on farm. I'm on BM. And then and there. I'm on the politics. I'm on the campaign. I'm on candidates. Ah, light your fine your politics. Yet to tell light among assembly members. I saw a mumbo, I will move community move. But I ne move some assembly members in the San Ecosuana. Now, so if you want more, maybe say MPP in some form of some bomb coco. Enter say your two about mom with your Tama Central. I almost say your Bantama, then on my Matama Central. Medassi, and I'm. Oh, yeah, 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 Me pacho, ah bra, bra. Me me pacho, aye, why, aye? Se waka wase me we, aye. Mama mi nenga sa, aye. Me pac, mame. Hello na. Yes, your friend was saying. Yeah. Who how me say? Me pacho, me besa me bisa se. The Masentwa, your city MP. I already knew noy. He did fantastic work in the constituency. I don't know why. For just four years, they are changing him. Why? Nino is doing well. Why are they changing? He's a good MP. They should tell us why they are changing. Nino is doing well. So we are asking the chairman. They should tell us why they have changed Nino. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Yes, yes, madam. Okay. Me pacho. Yes, madam. Your friend from Pama. Madam from Pama. Me pacho. Your friend from Pama. Yes, madam. Eh, yeah, yeah, Papa Charles Watson. Yeah, Papa Charles Watson. Ah, what you want? 
Omeye MP, but Obaye, no more Oye. Jai Brahmi, Jai Jai Nancy. Yo, aye, 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 aye. Yes, madam from Poma. I find that home. Calm your people down. Please calm your people down. Please calm your people down. All right, Madam Frepoma, please. We can hear you on air. Yet you won't have a team in the show. We need to cast our mic and get better. Who to make us out? Aye. Cast a good mic, Nimi. Nepa. Cast a. Cast a. Mama, me patch your cast away. Cast a. Yes, Madam from Poma, I find a home. Me pacho, ya from from Poma. Kasa good mic nim. Me ya from from Poma. Me pacho. Wey ona bota twasin. Ome ya MP, but oba ya no. E juma wa ya no. E ma no muto andi ya no. Wa support to him. E na when. Me pacho, ya ti wonka. Hello. 
Hello. Hi. Can we have some silence? Can we have some silence? Ago. Ago. Amen. Ago. Amen. I was in a four. Yet the TV three. Yet the TV three. I see. I want to go now. I'm Both honorable Charles Fawson and a new parliamentary candidate. Madam Ibi Bright has also been a third time parliamentary candidate. Comparative analysis. Obi Awajina three times. What major significant development? Bang! And why you are Tama Central? Awajina three times, three times. It is bright. Is it? Is it just uh, red, just looking for power? Just because of power, or ready to serve? She is not ready to serve. But the reason why she is not ready to serve, and he said, "Why did not first one? She was she was bold enough to ask a new parliamentary candidate, ah, uh, Onu Balo. He said, in terms of employment, that one why? Onu in employment, employment one why? Employment one what what that girl? What what has she done about employment during assembly elections, recent ones?" By assembly elections are not supposed to be partisan. However, we had Ibi Bright lowering the standard of her MP and involving herself into what? Assemblyman member partisanship. Is he doing politics or is he to serve the community? Lastly, Ibi Bright has nothing for Tema Centra. If she has something for Tema Centra, by now, she should have taken practical solutions for the youth. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Just recently, Honorable Charles Fossil has done uh, a lot of manhole exercises. All okay. Right. Whereby the ceiling of yes, what our waters. What has she done? All right. Eddie Bright should go All right. and do her homework. Thank she you. has nothing for the out the Thank youth you. of Tama Central. Thank you. Honorable Charles Fossil. Has Thank empowered you. the young ones Thank by you. giving them a Thank you. A Thank, certain you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. Aye, 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 aye. Aye, aye, aye. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let me come to. Let me come to our leader sitting in front here. All right, let's calm down, calm down, calm down. Let me come to our leader sitting in front here. I'll come back here, we'll take 10 comments from here. But first, let's listen to our leaders, see what they have to say, and then we'll go back to the open microphone. All right. Go. Ch Charles Fawson. Charles Fawson. Charles Fawson, let me start with you. Right after Amy Bright spoke, you said you wanted to respond to some of the issues on youth unemployment and sewage, which you said you had practical solutions to. All right, please respond to them. Not do anything with 2,000 cities by her own stronghold to our bottom to our bottom we offered 50 people 50 individuals just 500 Ghana cities and it has transformed the lives of those people today we are going to do the same an additional 50 people but because I am an employer because I'm an employer I know how much the value proposition for money 2,000 if the person is killed 
if the person is good, can can the person can transform the 2000 to a meaningful uh, business. And and all the 10, 10, 10 we are taking from all all those institutions, they are making impact in their life. So she can go about saying that uh, 2000 cannot do anything for somebody. I'll give you a critical one. Just last week. She didn't say 2000 cannot do anything. She was asking that if you give them 2000 cities each, are you adding opportunities, skills training, and things of course, that will teach them what how you are to coming use to do with it. What if you have 2000? What are you going to do with it? We just don't dash. It's a grant. But we ask somebody says he's coming to use it for pork and fries. You don't need much. Somebody who wants to do Indomie. The person doesn't need much. And we are happy. In fact, you'll be amazed how much, how much impact the money that we are in, impacting in people is doing there. I'm saying that if, if you live in a real business world, you know that even 500 can change somebody's life. And all right. Uh, all two of them. 50, 50 people, 500 cities seat additional capital. And the magic is doing for their in their life. Today, we are doing an additional work for some uh, 50 people in another squatter community. It's about impacting in people's life. And I'm saying that by, by December, I would have impacted in the lives of 500, 500 people by giving them a grant of 2,000 2, cities. All right. Yes. Now, when the... The open mic and, and, and began. The, the women. Yes, the women uh, have the, asked for specific things. Did you, did you yes, hear their yes. questions? Uh, she will acknowledge that we are fixing an additional meter, electricity meter here. They've, they've planted the earth and what have you. By next week, all the, the uh, security lights will be fixed. It here requires a ramp. We need to talk to the assembly. I cannot on my own. I have the money to do it, but I, I need approval from the assembly to do it. All right. Yes. Okay. And, and let him say, was, was uh, the NDC woman thinks that 2000 cannot do it? We are coming to start a special purpose project here. We are giving, we'll be giving grant to some 50 women. In the market. free loan. 2000. And you see what it will do in their life. Is it a loan or a grant? A grant. A grant. Yes. yes. All yes. right. Abi, some specific questions were asked directly to you. And, and you let, also let, had let, the market let, women. Let me add this. Let me add this. Let's be honest. Her own sewer from the seventh. I fix it. Her own, her own. I fix all on my own. What is she doing? What is she doing? What is she all doing? Right. You wait for you wait for leverages. No. no. All right. Abby, the gentleman in the black and white suit had questions for you, saying that you had run three times and he wanted to know the interventions you had introduced. As a three-time aspirant. All right, can I have your microphone, please? Hello. Great. Hello. Thank you. So, I'd like to respond to the specific issues raised. I'd like to respond uh, to the specific issues raised, first of all, by the market uh, women organizer. Um, I think speed ramps, it's, when, when we're talking about redevelopment, you need to consider what use the space is for and respond accordingly. So I think that needs to be uh, incorporated. Now, she talked about the market construction. Ago, Ago, please tell your people to calm down. Mr. Fossil, Mr. Fossil, please tell your people. So she talked about the design of the new market building. And this is the point. We don't do projects just because we're responding to noise. You have to design sustainable projects. She's talking about the size. What kind of consultation went into the design of a space that is meant for them? Their needs and their wishes should be paramount. So I think there, has, there needs to be broader stakeholder engagement in terms of a pro, uh, the, the project. Also, if you ask the pro, uh, market women, they're not sure about the state of any of the projects ongoing. But this is something that the right accountability will take care of. 
Because if you carry people along with town hall meetings and involve them in the project, if you're committed to a level of transparency, they will understand the issues, the challenges to do with the project. They won't feel so hopeless. But I want to challenge the MPP that the lack of transparency in the project, the reason why there's not enough consultation with the market women is that even in the allocation of the final work, they're not going to have their needs met. Anyway, she talked about information center and how the channels of um, the channels of communication have broken down. For me, this is deliberate because the more people have their voices and they can speak up, the more accountability uh, you mean, you mean the, yes, the, the, yeah, the information centers, yeah, the broadcasting here. systems. So I want to promise the people of Tema Central that one thing I will assure them in the first six months of being MP is that Tema Central will have our very own radio station dedicated to Tema Central and its voices. We will have our own TV station dedicated to Tema Central and to amplify its voices. We have a lot of kids, we have the creative sector that needs space for expression and celebration. We need a constituency, constituency sanctioned and promoted avenue to explore all these um, uh, avenues for our children. So this is one thing that I can promise her. So moving on for that, and I thank her. Now she was talking about funds, and that's why I asked the corrupt man who is sharing money all over the place. Because why are you calling him corrupt? I'm calling him corrupt because no individual's pockets can go around sharing money to people. It has to be structured, it has to be non-partisan, it has to be responsive, not self-serving. But he's we providing seed capital to women's young people bank. who want to set up yes, businesses. How does, he, how does he choose who should receive what? What is the fund set up? What is the transparency in the process? Is it a Tema Central fund? Is it a non-partisan administered fund? Or is it a personal initiative? Oh, G G G2000, exactly. Where is this, what is the source of his money? How can an individual take care of Tema Central? Then why hasn't he transformed the lives of all of us up till date? You know, this is a fluke. And we in Tema Central, we've advanced way beyond those kind of pedestrian talk. We are talking about the Women's Bank. If we concertedly empower our women to access the facilities, of a national bank for women. That is legitimate, that is not subjective. It is as objective as possible, and it will allow opportunities for all women, regardless of whether they are my relative, they are my friend, they are whoever they are, they should be able to access that. That is the kind of MP that we are promising you from the NDC. Not an MP who is taking care of a party people, but an MP who is looking at a social structure that is equitable and free and fair. So, madam, these are my, my, my responses to her issues. Okay. The assemblyman for horticulture, he talked about cold football. And this is a very, very important thing. This is a very important thing for the economy of Tema Central. I am very disappointed that as somebody coming from the tradition of the MPP, he has not even bothered to give due recognition and acknowledgement to the first MP for Tema Central, who from his activities from Tema East into Tema Central, built a very thriving cold system league in this constituency. If you look at the very little development in the um, schools around Tema Central, their fields were developed, those that have been developed. These were developed because they have relationships with the local cold clubs. That they, how, whereby they share their facilities. And this has brought, you know, a shared development. The schools have their pitches developed, and we have a, co um, a thriving cold um, league. But successive MPP regimes have failed to even appreciate that. It's one in, one out. Instead of understanding that there are good things that we can build on. For me, that is one project the first MP did that I am that I am determined Tema Central should continue to enjoy because our football talents deserve the opportunity to shine. So that is All it. Right.
We also have, you talked about the sewer okay, lines. Quickly. And quickly. about the fact that we've been struggling with this. This is not something that your pockets can fund on an individual basis. If you don't like my face, you do. So don't ask me, I've never been in government. So that's one thing they should remember. Tema Central is in the state it still is because you have not given a bright the opportunity. Three times, this is the third time, they should do the right thing so that they have right. better leadership. Thank all you. All right, all right. Let's come back to you. All right, all right. Go. Who, who, these are some of my street lights. What is that? These are street lights. Okay. Right here and now, we are donating we're donating six street lights for the market. All right, let me come to you over here. Who has the microphone? All right. Hello? Yes, sir. Hello? Hello? My name, my name is Paul. My name is Paul. Today, Abby Bright is saying that the uh, youth is, does not have work. That they have the locals to say that. When they were selling the tobacco companies, what were they thinking? When the NDC party were selling the tobacco companies, what were they thinking? Were they not taking our jobs from our hands? When they were selling the tobacco companies, when the NDC were selling the tobacco companies, what were they thinking? And today, you want to come and talk of unemployment? You want to come and talk of unemployment? When you are selling the companies, you want to talk of unemployment? Who, who are selling the companies? And this when you have sold all the tobacco companies. We have revised five of them, five. They sold which tobacco five. companies? Let me, explain, let me mention them to you. Let me mention yes, them to you. Yes, please mention them. Super Paper, their sold is collapsed. GTMC is collapsed. Vaco, we have to revive it back. Tema Fishing, uh, Publishing, a lot of companies that the NDC have sold. And today they want to talk of unemployment. NDC want to talk of unemployment. You said the NDC sold these companies to who? Let me come back to the street light. The street light. We have, me, myself, and the MP and Charles Fawcett, we have shared 1,005 street lights. I am part of those who put it around. What is he talking about? 400. Who did he give it to? All right. The thing they said they have shared is what is here. So they have not shared it. They said they have shared street light. All right. They said they have shared street light. This is the street light. They have not shared it. These are the they street were going lights to sell it. that they are installing. They were you going say to you have installed so 1,500 street lights. They have not shared any street light. This is okay. The, they have well, not shared it. Okay. Hello, madam. Yes, sir. The patrol, me and Mikina have been here from the Richard. All the NDC communicators here are my friends. But they definitely know that when you talk about development, NDC can't know here. Niami are a holy set. Tamaha, then you are sister Cynthia. Yanini now, Tamaha. You are two of you are pet, no one you are. Or Kenya, four years, no one unity. Me, media, Papa, we mean Muno. We need to power up and market a new rush of forcing. I will register a man. We are not going to any say. And this is me. I will be the six hundred cities. So all the boys, the juma, all the old market a. And this is Mrs. Satna. I can say. We are not money. 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 We are not Omo dia adie bia e be ma ohiani ana mo bro wa aye wie no mpe na me me a part of the system enu ti mi se papa we me no ka sei wo kwa industrial area ya ya road a ya baba gusu asphalt na mami we mami we a ya mi nua ba Cynthia nya ya me ya aye awra ho ni se se onu ogbu assembly no enti amra kwa onya djuma amra o fe nyam na nya djuma was this a billboard? Was this a billboard? One day permit. Who can also an NDC candidate? Was it a billboard? Street lights. Street lights. 
Or we shall from 2022. No, that is our street lights. And then one one. program we are doing. We are doing a photo street light. Where are your gimmick? Where are your matter of fact? And this is the only move. You are too happy with your tomorrow. We are not prepared for that. Adia Chanua Samba. Never again. Every bright. Cynthia. Every bright. Cynthia. Never again. No. No. On my account, I know. Every bright. I'm not a Okay, don't cross the cameras. 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 No, 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 no. Don't cross the cameras. Don't cross the Don't cross the camera. 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 Are you, are you done with your points? Are you done hello, with your hello, points? Hello, hello, hello. Sit down hello. and make your points. Sit down. Yes. No. Please, can you? Hello. Yeah, yeah, can you say? Other way, be bright. Oh, no power that. Oh, no power that. For the three consecutive times, no more can. And no more than they've been here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. My guys, women, more way. Other boy, every bright. Hey, Tabo, sweet light. Talk to about Kubia S. Motel. And no, Anna Yaka. And no, Yaka. And then Anna Maya for the past 12 years. For the past 12 years. And then Anna Maya. For the past 12 years. And then Anna Maya. 12 years. Maya day. 12 years. Maya day. 12 years. Maya day. Listen down. And no one's up in Yaka. Baby, I don't know. Baby, I don't know. And Yaka's a sense thing. And yet, that's a thing. Sit down, sit down. 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 Just sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. Sit down. No, no, no. Sit down, sit down. I will, give, I will give you a microphone. Sit down. I need you to sit down. Please, let's not cross. Let's not cross the microphone. Let's not cross. Let's not cross. Thank you. Sit down. Sit down. When we go to our schools, there are many problems. That's why we talk about the issues. When the problems are here, how many people? It is not about shouting. This is what we are talking about. So if you come here and you be shouting, 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 and you know what's on the aircraft, let us go down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. We are talking about track record. We are talking about track record. It is not about shouting. What are you saying? Okay. It is track record we are talking about. Okay. Now we are angry. We are angry because this is the harbor city. I can tell. This is the mouth of Ghana. This I'm is the city it. that I, feeds I, the whole garden. I gave you what a microphone. Where is it? We cannot keep quiet okay. over okay. things you are not doing right. These street slides that you have brought here, where are you going to install them? Okay, the market woman. For the market woman. The market women. woman who came to complain. Other people will be bright in saying that as soon as possible. Let's, let's, say, let's do a face. presentation to them. Come again. Let's do a presentation no. to them. So call the market woman. Market woman. Honorable. 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 Just do a presentation to her as a market woman. Aha. Well, you know. Hello. Mami. In some people there who be too young, you know. And you know, you know, you bet me I am there. That's what a banner light is here. And you know, they are ongoing projects. In the box, you know, you know, and the room. Udiei aya ten, me mau five boxes. Let's just say street light, baku baku ten, and ne aya udia makatadia. Dia kanu ya betu ana mo. What? Assemblyman now kasanu onu mama ne twenty. 